Hey guys, Cresty here. Uh, sorry for how I haven't uploaded in a while, but there's a good reason for it. You see, I've been working on theories about video games. I was going to make a channel dedicated to it, but somebody beat me to the punch. They copied everything I was going to do. Now the Pope has two copies of Undertale. Anyways, my theory is this. Every good video game features bananas in one way or the other. I mean, some people like to call a life a game, and does it feature bananas? Really good ones actually, pretty well detailed. Yo, is there ray tracing on this banana? However, the game of life doesn't seem to have any bananas. If your family ever wants to play that game on a family night, just refer to the crusty banana theory. Uh, let's go through a couple of games that feature and do not feature bananas. Here comes a new challenger! Ah yes, the critically acclaimed Dominion Rush, of course it has bananas! Such is to be expected with such a high quality game, it's even the main collectible. Minion Rush is an endless runner game that you can play on your phone, so you can play it wherever you want. Funeral? Minion Rush! During class? Minion Rush! The point is, Minion Rush is awesome, and the bananas in it are one of the main reasons why it is so good. Minecraft, the best-selling game of all time. Being so critically acclaimed, it has to feature bananas. Okay, so it doesn't feature bananas. But hold on, hold on, you can technically get mods that add in bananas and monkeys. You can also build giant bananas. You can't consume them though, sadly, but the spectacle of the banana is enough. You can also do this. Have I mentioned how I really hate apples? Anyways, yeah, Minecraft approved! Here comes a okay, I need to stop delaying the inevitable. It's Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Tropical Freeze! One of the best platformers out there, with a lovable main character and amazing banana collectibles. This is the game that proves the banana theory. And if you get 100 bananas, you get an extra life, which certainly delivers a message to the players. If you don't involve bananas in your life, you're living a life not worth living. <laughs> That's a really cool death jingle. I should try dying sometime. That would be funny. Oh, uh, somebody's calling me on my banana phone. Cresty, your banana theory isn't true. How about this? If you can prove that... Garfield cart has bananas in it, then your theory is correct, and you get the award for best theorist ever. Best theorist ever award? I have dreamed of winning that reward ever since yesterday. Although, I'm not sure if I want to play Garfield cart. I have the perfect idea. I'll use Reddit. Okay, I may have used the wrong subreddit, but Christianity has all the answers. I guess I have no choice now but to become an atheist. Well, at least I can play League of Legends now. But on second thought, do I really want to? Oh yeah, bananas and gaming. So in conclusion, I don't think Garfield Car features bananas, even with such a high rating on Metacritic. Well, I guess I won't get the best theorist award, but I don't ne need awards to make myself feel valid. I'm valid in my own way, and I don't need awards to prove that fact.